And good evening, everybody. Thank you for being with us tonight. I'm Eric Fink. Gabriel Altamirano, the second suspect in a deputy involved shooting last Tuesday on Tucson's southwest side, faced a judge tonight for the first time. Altamirano is now behind bars facing charges for attempted murder, aggravated assault with a deadly weapon, burglary and more. He has a preliminary hearing set for August 28th. Pima County Sheriff Chris Nanos held a news conference earlier today, just hours after the arrest. Take a listen. At about 2.30 in the morning, one of our deputies was flagged down in the area of Irvington and uh, Midvale Park area. Uh, he was told that Mr. Altamirano was in the area and was armed. And around 6 this morning, law enforcement had him surrounded in the Santa Cruz wash near Irvington and Midvale. Altamirano surrendered and was taken into custody. On the morning of August 13th, just five days ago, deputies saw Altamirano, who was a suspect in a domestic violence case, driving by. He and a passenger, the other suspect, drove off but ended up crashing into another car. Altamirano got out of the car and tried to run. During the chase, PCSD says Altamirano shot Deputy Augustine Gonzalez in the leg. Sheriff Nanos also saying today Deputy Gonzalez is recovering and doing well. 